What's poppin' Pisces? I'm Laurel, and welcome to Love Pisces in this mother sucker, baby. Join me as I read you you all's lives. Thank you to everyone who has liked, shared, commented, subscribed to my channel. Baby, you already know I appreciate each and every single one of you Pisceans. Yes, I do, baby. And if you need to get a personal reading from me, make sure that you hit that description box down below and check out my website, laurelsmoon.com for any other magical purposes and deviation workings and things of that nature. So make sure you check out my four questions for $35 down in the description box down below via video only Friday through motherfucking Sunday in this bitch. So Pisces, Let's see what's going down for the motherfucking weekend in this bitch. And while you guys are here, go ahead and put chocolate on in the algorithms. Oh, Pisces. Let's see what's going down, baby spirit. You are welcome into this Piscean reading. You must sage. For all of my Piscean gods. Alright babies. Now y'all know how I do. I go from Friday to motherfucking Saturday. All the way until Sunday in this hoe. So I want you guys to go ahead and put that pretty little index finger on that like, share, and subscribe button for your motherfucking girl. Now Pisces. I wasn't getting too many clear audio messages. It was just like bitch do it. Okay, just do it. Straight like that. So, light up, smoke up, toke up. Do what you got to do. Kick your Pisces motherfucking feet up in this hole. Pisces, you guys already know I love each and every single one of you all for all of your support. I am so grateful. So, let's find out what's happening for Friday all the way until Saturday in this bitch. For my Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Penis, North Node, and for my South Node, and for my Mars. Let's see what's going down for my Pisces. All right, now we got Catfish and Compass. So I know this ain't my Pisces navigating to nobody's goddamn catfish now. Okay, now... I feel like some of you guys might be uh, dealing with uh, closing yourself off, but you got angelfish here, but okay. So, with this angelfish, this is something that you are cutting off a lot of the dead motherfucking weight. I feel like uh, for a lot of you Pisces, this could be you just keeping to yourself. We got flying fish, so this is some sort of information, or this could be somebody that's bringing you some news here. With this flying fish. Okay. And bubbles as well too. So yes. There's some information. Some of you guys are just comfortable in your motherfucking cold baby. Okay. But you got hidden treasure here. So there could be something that's ducked off that you hidden from. I also feel like for some of you Pisces. You could be salty about uh, somebody who you're closed off to. Okay. Or this person could be salty and closed off towards you. So let's see what's going down for my Pisces darling. I'm going to get... Golden Girls Tarot here. For my Pisces. Give it to me for the weekend. Starting from Friday. Give me the energies they need to know about. Queen of Pentacles here. So some of you guys are all about your motherfucking coin in this bitch. Okay. Some of y'all spinning things with your hand. Okay. Also 10 of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck, baby. Wow. So this is some financial gain is what I'm seeing here, Pisces. This also could be you just chilling at your house, making motherfucking money. Okay, for some of you guys, this also might be uh, you just closing yourself off with this hermit energy here. All right. I'm seeing something that uh, you're just not really impressed to. Okay, some, some of you guys could have been dealing with a Virgo and Taurus Capricorn. Okay, some of you guys could have gotten some information or some news from an ex or an old dusty hater as well too i'm seeing that with the four of pentacles and also the strength energy here in reverse okay emperor energy as well 
Definitely could be dealing with a fire sign. Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. Okay, somebody feels like they are not confident to stand tall towards you. Okay. You have the Three of Swords, also a page of wands. Could be some sort of information, like I said, that somebody wants to reach out to you. Okay, somebody's wearing their heart on their motherfucking sleeve with this Three of Swords here. Pipes. Let me put on my motherfucking glasses, honey. Because we got the devil coming out once again, so... I don't know if y'all dealing with a Capricorn. Tell me in the comments down below or what. Or if some of y'all got uh, a lot of feelings that's moving away. Okay, towards deception. Okay, Decepticon. And this mother sucker. You got the devil energy here. Okay, also three of swords. So this could be some information, some news. So let's see Friday night in this bitch. All right, Eight of Swords coming out. Tower energy here. So this could be a possible Scorpio. Also seeing Pisces here that somebody's um, going to be having a burst of their motherfucking emotions. Okay, this could be a change. Just a simple change for some of you guys. But with this moon energy here coming out, people getting ready to let it all out, baby. Okay, act a buffoon, act a straight ass with this motherfucking moon, baby. Okay, so I'm seeing information, text messages coming your way as well, too. Somebody could be thinking about dialing your motherfucking number you got the three of wands at the uh, bottom of the deck okay let me like this because i feel like for some of you guys it needs to be some sort of calming energy okay but you do have the eight of wands coming out so pisces i'm seeing that somebody let me get my musical cards and clarify this it's trying to message you talk to you okay the devil is here baby and all of my decks is what i'm seeing so far we got happily ever after by K. So somebody's either trying to reach out to you. Okay, are you thinking about your own happily ever after? But you got body party by Sierra. Okay, this also could be somebody that's leaving away from a third party situation. You got body reoperated boyfriend, baby. So some of y'all could be dealing with just fingering yourself, okay? Doing your own damn thing. Okay, choking the chicken. Whatever you want to call this shit. All right, some of y'all just ain't even worried about it by nothing. But somebody wants to get in your jeans, Pisces. Okay, I feel like somebody definitely is hiding their emotions for you with this orange moon popping off. So with this uh, new moon that's coming in, baby. Somebody got feelings for you, okay? Coming out is choices, E40. So some of y'all got choices towards your partner or your partner has choices towards you. But somebody's trying to figure some shit out. Okay, you're trying to figure it out if somebody's a player. Okay, or they need to go on ahead and write uh, you some letters, tell you some things. Okay, about how they truly feel. So, Pisces, we about to find out what's popping for Saturday. I'm going to get Terror Royale. So, here we go, Pisces. Saturday. I feel like uh, either a Libra or a possible Leo Sagittarius Aries is very desperate around you or somebody is extremely desperate. Okay, I don't know if this is desperado or what. But you got King of Swords here coming out. Very first energy for Saturday. Also Nine of Cups. So some of you guys are just putting on that poker motherfucking face and being stone cold Steve Austin and getting your happiness. Okay, also moving things into an alignment as well too with this Nine of Cups. This could be living in your luxury, being happy, okay? Especially standing tall on a situation that you have cut off. You have the moon energy here, so you're giving it some time. Or there could be some emotions. Also, another Piscean energy that's here. Okay, three of wands keeps coming out. So somebody's either leaving a third-party situation behind or somebody's disappointed, okay? You got the star energy here. Also, the three of swords. Wow. So there's definitely some sort of third-party situation where somebody is not feeling special here. Okay, Ace of Cups coming out, Ace of Pentacles, okay, and also King of Cups. So I'm seeing some of y'all's like, fuck it, let's ride this motherfucker. We about to get this motherfucking money. I see me uh, happy than a motherfucker. I got to keep my eyes open, okay, especially if there is love that could be around or a possibility of somebody who's not showing their emotions towards you with this King of Cups in reverse here. But I do feel like you got brand new motherfucking new beginnings with both of these cards coming out. Also Magician Energy here. What's this magician here for? For Saturday. Nine of Swords. Also, Seven of Pentacles. Something you're definitely thinking about if somebody's on some con artistry or some fuckery here. Okay, Ten of Wands. 
Let's see what's popping for Saturday night. I do see a lot of work. Okay, some of you guys might be looking into your investments. Okay, this could be uh, going into your closet and looking, what's, looking at what's hung up. All right, you also have the Two of Pentacles and the Six of Swords. So I feel somebody is leaving away from a situation. Okay, this also could be some sort of travel or having to decide multiple things. Some of y'all could be having to uh, pay some things here as well too. But I feel like you got the money to do it with this page of pentacles also could be dealing with virgo and taurus capricorn or a child here you have the knight of pentacles so i feel things are going to be pretty active here all right also could be at a distance but i'm seeing with the knight of wands and also with the page of pentacles you could be going back and forth in your head about a leo sagittarius aries okay also if you want to hold on to a situation or if you want to uh give into it this could be sexual as well too but you got a lot of uh aces and wands here so there could be a start you got the tower energy coming out okay so there could be some major changes that's definitely abrupting or somebody could be pop goes in the motherfucking weasel you got the high priestess energy here that's coming out this also is somebody that feels like they have to miss you or they miss you a lot baby okay yeah, somebody's coming with some sort of apology or they feel left out in the cold. Okay, somebody's very angry here. Now, Ten of Pentacles. Okay, also Ten of Swords and Chariot Energy here and Seven of Swords. So you might be seeing where I can't say any. And also Leo. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius could be uh, being deceptive or being dishonest. Okay, but definitely very possessive. Or some of you guys could be getting that major coin. This could be money that's moving to you in your sleep as well, too. Let's see what's popping for Sunday because I do feel like somebody's playing a lot of games with this King of Swords here, whether or not you got conversation with their ass or not. Okay, let's see what's going down for Sunday. Give it to me for Pisces, my Pisces darlings. Give it to me for my Pisces. For Sunday, some of you guys could be dealing with just assessing some things or reevaluating. This also could be cutting some shit off or just, you know, seeing what you've experienced all along. But I'm seeing that for some of you guys, you definitely feel like it could be something that you have to quickly, uh, you know, or just use a lot of wit. Um, but I'm seeing that for a lot of you guys, this could be just using your sense of humor and reflection. But I feel like with the lover's energy here, there could be some sort of struggle within temptation or... Or somebody could be having some issues with the connection or just their sexuality altogether when it comes down to Sunday. Seven of Wands here. Could be some sexual aggression or sexual healing that somebody needs. Ten of Cups and also Moon Energy. Could be some sort of confusion or some fears or just phobias that are around. Okay, this also could be with a family situation or just being at peace with a family or being in serenity. All right, this also could be an event with other people or some sort of harmony here. Ten of Cups, Ace of Pentacles. Wow. All right, Pisces. So some of you guys got money that's either leading to you, okay, or there could be a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Um, I feel like there, there's a possible torn energy here as well, too. Also, Aquarius, okay, where somebody feels like they could be blocking change or just could be changing the order, being very stagnant, keep be, be, being very greedy here. Okay, also could be somebody who's saving or saving some things for the best for last, that type of shit. You got the two of swords, so somebody who might be at a stalemate. Okay, Sunday night, I feel like some of you guys are just getting some rest. With this tower energy here, there could be a sudden change. I don't know what's going on. You got the star, the tower, somebody who's not healed, could be possible scorpion. Also devil energy, somebody that is bonded to you. Okay, you got the fool, somebody that's coming out of nowhere. You got a pop goes a motherfucking weasel. Again. Okay, somebody who can't let it go that you are free from. Okay, and I feel like uh, there's a lot of skill and just prosperity that's around you, Pisces. But I feel like somebody is trying to set something into motion here. Okay, but with this full energy here, I feel like somebody's just acting on impulse. Very impulsive type of energy coming out. So, give me the overall energies that Pisces needs to know about for Sunday. Here we go, Pisces. Yeah, somebody's popping up. You got lusty here. <laughs> so either somebody's craving after your body or somebody could be very lusty around you. 
Okay, they could be wanting to see and taste and touch your ass. You got eating groceries and uh-oh. So somebody, oh, speak ancestors. So either somebody could be lying, okay, or somebody's a liar that's coming around or doing some pop goes a weasel ass shit. You got eating groceries as well, too, or somebody that wants to tell you some sort of war story just so they can get in your draws. But I'm seeing with the uh, war and battle here and cutthroat, you're going to have to be very, very real about your shit. Yeah, look, pop-up is here. Fuck. So, yeah, somebody could be popping up. Okay, this is that weasel here. Okay, it says, don't fuck with me. So whoever this is, it could be somebody you told not to fuck with you or they told you not to fuck with them. And here it is, they coming. You got foreign and flesh and blood and shopping. So some of you guys could be going shopping. Okay, you could be hanging up clothes. But I feel like somebody's acting reckless. Okay, they're acting like a crash dummy doing whatever, wherever. All right. Somebody is following you for sure with this sheep and throne of gold. Okay, this is definitely a little radio here, baby. They on that motherfucking gas, smoking that gas, baby. Okay, they might not be smoking real gas. They might be smoking some other gas, okay? But yeah, you got snitches get stitches and coming up. So somebody's watching you either come up or somebody that's trying to, uh, you know, speak up on some shit or uh, it could be somebody who's talking too much. You got sucker here and coming up. Okay, so yeah, somebody want to tell you something or they got a secret to tell you or they... Little lie is coming out. You got blocked and copy paste. Could be somebody that's trying to copy and paste your style, your hair, okay, your hair color, your nails, all that shit. Somebody could be blocked. They watching you through their motherfucking phone. All right. Now some of y'all might have a little uh, night rider coming through and marry me. Somebody trying to pop up on your motherfucking ass. Now this could be that narcissistic energy, but I feel like this is definitely somebody who wants that after party with you. Okay. Yeah, we got skills here. All right, Pisces, page of swords at the bottom of the deck and knight of cups. So I don't know if this person is trying to do some instantaneous shit or this motherfucker's going to combust or some shit like that. Okay, because it says shit's about to get real and message. So somebody either wants to put in the body work or they got a message for you, baby. You might have to sage this motherfucker. It might be a little old ass demon that you can cast it away from you. Okay, or somebody's trying to reach out to you. One of the two. I love you, Pisces, all oh, so much. Let me know what you all think in the comments down below. Very interesting reading. And make sure, like I said, you check out my four questions for $35.55. I love you, Pisces, all oh, so much. And also, let me know what the next reading should be. I am going to be doing the singles here pretty soon. So stay tuned for that. I love you, Pisces, all oh, so much. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.